Hey everybody, uh, Michael Kwan here from Mega Tech News. I'm here with Matthew from uh, Cisco, and he's going to show us some of the new routers and the new software innovations that they brought to us. So the router we've got in front of you is our EA6500 HD Video Pro. It's our first AC router that we're bringing to the market. On 2.4 gigahertz band, we're still gonna give you great speed with 450 megabits per second, but on the five gigahertz band, where you're really gonna see the difference is, you're now gonna be able to transfer internally on your network at 1300 megabits per second. So almost three times as fast as what you would get out of the current market uh, routers today. The great part of our EA6500 HD Video Pro is, we've actually launched the media connector alongside it. So for the user that has got an Xbox at home, a PS3, maybe a smart TV and a Blu-ray player, you're gonna be able to use a device like this to plug all four of those in. And now at AC speeds of up to 1300 megabits per second, talk back to your AC router at you know, wired speeds that you never would have been able to get before with uh, 802.11 and technology. On the software side, a lot, a lot has changed too because people want to make it easier to set up and they want to be able to control their routers from afar. Uh, can you tell us a little bit about that? With our Linksys Smart Wi-Fi software platform, we're going to allow you to manage, access, control your network on a daily basis from the touch of your hand, whether that would be you know, accessing your Linksys Smart Wi-Fi account from your iPad, from an Android device, from your iPhone, anywhere, anytime, you can get access to what's happening on your network, make changes, add guest network, change parental controls, or even just manage the devices that you want to connect to every day. So can you tell me a little bit more about the Smart Wi-Fi app? Sure, so within our Linksys Smart Wi-Fi app, we're gonna show you the device list, everything that's connected to your network. We're gonna show you the guest network, what the username and password is if you wanted to share that with someone. We're gonna show you how to do media prioritization. So take what's most important to you in your network, whether that's your LG Smart TV or a Netflix stream to your tablet, and put that in the highest priority queue, which is really important because we think those are the things that are happening on a daily basis. But beyond that, we're also gonna allow you to go into the general tools of the router and look at the overall connectivity. Check the status of your firmware and see if it requires an update. Look at VPN settings or DLNA settings. Again, all from our Linksys Smart Wi-Fi app, you can see and control and manage your network anytime from anywhere on an Android device or an iOS device. And there's even a virtual WPS button, so if people want to connect to the network real easy that way too. Absolutely, so if you wanted to help someone that just brought home a new Wi-Fi printer, you would be able to associate with their account, do a manual or soft version of the WPS button, and help them get that printer online. And the apps go even further, because you have uh, third-party developers that are working within that uh, ecosystem. We actually have six apps in the marketplace. They're Linksys Smart Wi-Fi apps, and because they're able to log in through our Linksys Smart Wi-Fi username and password, once you've done so, you're going to have access and control to all of the devices or network traffic happening on the back end. Some of those include an app like NetProofer, which will allow you to control access to certain applications like Facebook, uh, LinkedIn, Netflix, YouTube, and at certain times of the day, turn it off to anyone that might be using it. Or if you want to allow some folks to continue to use it while others are turned off, they'll allow you to do that on, an on a device level as well. So very different way of looking at how to manage the applications and the controls that your network allow you to do, but in a simple to use app from one of our third party developers. So there's already the easy setup for the average person, but what about the person that really likes to be able to tweak their settings man manually and really get in there? In our Linksys Smart Wi-Fi tool, we allow you to make some of those settings, but we also recognize that there was an important piece of being able to locally manage it for every setting that you've come to know and love from our Linksys brand. So at the same time as having a Linksys Smart Wi-Fi account, you can opt to create just a local access account only with your traditional IP address, enter in your browser, and go in and make those changes as well, where every little detail will be available to you. When should uh, people expect to have these shipping and, and available to them? They're actually available today at either Future Shop or Best Buy. Um, $219.99 for the router, $159.99 for the media connector, um, which is going to allow you to speak back to your router at AC speeds like you've never seen before. So that's the new routers from Linksys and Cisco. Uh, stay tuned to the Megatech News YouTube channel. We'll have lots more coverage for you. I'm Michael Kwan.